weekend. How good is it to get right into the rhythm with this team and contribute right away? Yeah, it was good. Good to get a little experience there early on, uh, kind of jumping right in there with the trip in Manitoba. But felt good to contribute early. Uh, team's been struggling a little bit offensively, so good to chip in and just uh, excited to help any way I can. Yeah, do you see yourself as a, you know, a primary goal scorer on this team? I don't know about primary goal scorer. I've never, I uh, don't think I've been known as a pure skill guy or goal scorer, but um, like I said, just trying to help any way I can. If it's the offensive touch, then uh, that's kind of where the focus is at right now. You've been focused on college hockey, obviously, but how long in the back of your mind have you been waiting for this opportunity to test your skills at this level? Yeah, absolutely. I think it's everyone's dream to, to make the hop at some point and play professional hockey. Um, coming from college, it's a little bit of change in style and pace, um, but it's one I'm looking forward to, and it's, a, it's another challenge for me, and that's kind of uh, one of the reasons I made the jump is to accept that next challenge and kind of hit the ground running here. How exciting is it to you know, join a team, too, that's like so close to the postseason where obviously you want to get some part? Yeah, it's exciting. Uh, they clinched there right before I, I joined the squad, so they had a little, little momentum, a little confidence. Um, and trying to keep that moving here towards the, the playoff push. Um, obviously getting back on track here in Iowa and then finishing up here at home. So it's an exciting time. Uh, excited to make that playoff push with these guys. What do you see as your strengths? You're not the biggest guy in the world, so I'm, I'm guessing physicality is not your thing. But. Yeah, no, I just try and play a good, uh, honest 200-foot game, be reliable in all zones, um, kill penalties, uh, produce offensively when, when needed. Um, and really just kind of fitting in any role I can right now. Um, this team's got a lot of great players, a lot of experience up and down the lineup. Um, so any spot I'm put in right now, I'm just trying to contribute and, and help any way I can. Any conversations with the coaching staff about their expectations for you here at the end of the season going into the playoffs? Uh, no, not really. Um, like I said, I got thrown in the lineup there in Manitoba. Kind of a quick turnaround for me. Um, getting the flight out of Chicago just the day before. Um, you know, just, just trying to, like I said, accept the role that I'm putting in and, and do it as well as I can. You got to play with two other younger guys, Kiro and Candace Stroza. How much fun was it playing out there with them? Yeah, awesome. Um, coming in, probably the one, a couple of the two guys I knew maybe the most uh, on the team. Um, so a little familiarity there with, with camp and, and just personalities. Um, and it was a good fit. Um, like we said, got it got it going there in the second second game a little bit. Um, like I said, any any role I'm put in here, I'm accepting it and, and just trying to do it the best I can. What do you see as, as maybe any difference between college and the AHL level? What do you see as the difference here? Yeah, I think uh, the style is a little different. Obviously, more pro style. Not uh, as many guys, you know, trying to run around. A lot more, more systems. Um, you know, just the pace is a little, is a little touch up as well. Um, you know, and just the, the depth. I think um, all teams have four lines and six D that can go. Um, goaltending is consistent every night as well. Um, so it's just, uh, you know, it's a good challenge for me and for uh, making the jump here. It's something I'll have to adjust to. Was college always the game plan coming out of high school? Juniors, yeah, anything? for me, uh, both my parents being teachers, um, college was was really the route um, for me to take there. Um, obviously, getting a, getting a good education there in Michigan um, is always important. Um, something I really really look forward to finishing up here in the near future. Um, but yeah, college was was really the route for me and one that I, I'm happy I took.